Hello everyone, welcome to another limited color palette video. So today I'm going to color this sketch that I drew at a skateboard shop the other day. I didn't have time to color it on location, so let's color it now. Let me show you the reference photo I took inside the shop. The name of the shop is Longboard Love and it's located in Singapore. So they sell mostly longboards and cruiser boards, not those uh, skateboards used to do tricks. And they also sell accessories like wheels, skateboard trucks, and a lot of other skateboard related items. Here's a closer look at the shop before I color it. So these are all the decks on the board and all these are the wheels, a lot of boxes, tools behind at the back of the shop. That's Jonathan servicing a skateboard that was brought in by a customer. Wheels and skateboard trucks on the wall. And these are the complete skateboards on the shelves. This is definitely not an easy sketch to sketch because there are a lot of details, a lot of wheels and a lot of boards. So I had to really simplify as much as I possible with the limited amount of time that I have. So you can see here for the skateboards in the back, it's just rectangles connected by this line. And then we have rectangles. This is a limited color palette video and the colors that I will be using today are from Renaissance Intense made in Poland. This is Indian Yellow PY83, Permanent Carmine PY, sorry, PR48, colon 4, Polish Brown PBR25, and Ultramarine Blue PB29. I still have some paint left over from the previous painting session, so I will use them as well. So Indian yellow, it looks uh, kind of warm, so maybe it's good to have this yellow. Right, first thing to do is to maybe paint the largest area. So I'm going to paint the shelves. It would be easier if I have um, raw sienna or yellow ochre for the shelves. So for this wall, this is, um, it looks more brown. So let's see if I can mix a brown for that. There are a lot of brown boxes here on the ground. For the background here, I'm going to color it a light gray. And for the flaws, that will be PBR25, Polish Brown. Daniel Smith also has this color, it's called Permanent Brown. It's a color that is great for mixing really dark colors. So if you have phthalo blue and this, you can mix a black like something really intense. Let's paint this gray as well. Mixing skin tones without raw sienna or yellow ochre for me, it's actually quite challenging. Which is why I usually have raw sienna and or yellow ochre. All right, so now it's time to paint the bright and vibrant colors for the boards. I probably should have uh, made the wall less colorful so that the colors 
for the skateboard trucks and the wheels can stand out there are a lot of wheels under this glass cabinet but it's difficult for me to draw all of them so I'm just going to paint um, all those things uh, with this color blend there are some really colorful boards here and the designs the artworks on the board some of them are actually really beautiful some can be quite intricate but of course it's going to be very difficult for me to actually replicate the art And the wheels they come in all sorts of different colors i'm not exactly uh, following the colors that i see in the photo okay just i'm um, adding some more details here this is ultramarine and pbr 25 you can use this to create like really dark colors This sketch is almost done. Now I just need to add some really um, dark areas to make certain areas, um, to let certain areas have more contrast. This brush that I'm using, this is the Silver Black Velvet, size 8. And the sketchbook, um, it's a custom made sketchbook with Fabriano Artistico watercolor paper. The bottom of the shelves here, they need to be darker because um, the top is blocking the light. So we need to make some darker colors for this part here. And let's make the center of the wheel black. Looks like the colors have dried very nicely. This is not an easy sketch to color because there are a lot of colors in this shop. The wheels are very colorful. The designs on the skateboards are also very colorful and there are a lot of details so if you are someone who is impatient, then uh, sketching something like this may be quite uh, challenging. Sketching with pen and ink is going to be very fun, but coloring is going to be very challenging because there are so many little shapes to color and so many things to color. So that's Ultramarine and PPR25. That's Permanent Carmine, Indian Yellow. Having Yellow Ochre or Raw Sienna um, is going to make mixing skin tones so much easier. So those are the skateboard wheels on the walls, the skateboard trucks. Skateboard trucks are basically what are uh, holding the wheels together. These are the skateboard trucks. Skateboarding is um, it's very fun. Just that in Singapore, it's very humid, so it's very it's going to get very sweaty if you use a skateboard do check out the video that i have made inside the skateboard shop 
um, the link will be in the video description below as well as the links to where you can find the excess watercolor paint that I am selling to make space to get more colors, more paint to test and to make more videos like this. All right, thank you guys for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.